What's good? All right. So I'm out here just walking. Figured I'd do this on live. <clears throat> Let's say it. I got a little, little junk in my throat, whatever. All right. So here's what we got. I want you one day to imagine you woke up and found out that you were Thor, right? Of Greek myth, uh, what's it? Norse mythology. You found out you were Thor. Ah, God, can't get any good light out here. So anyway, you find out that you're Thor. And uh, how you find out you're Thor is you end up getting whisked away to Valhalla, right? You end up getting whisked away to Valhalla and you're like, this is bullshit. But when you're in Valhalla, you meet Odin. And Odin is like, you're Thor. Now imagine you didn't believe in Norse mythology at all, and you thought everybody who believed in Norse mythology was dumb. Like, y'all are crazy, y'all are stupid for believing in this ridiculousness. And all of a sudden, it turns out that you, you are Thor, right? And then it's like, of course, you're going to doubt. And if you didn't believe in Norse mythology, you're going to be super skeptical. And you're going to be like, man, this is a hallucination. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're going to probably even be disrespectful to Odin. Like, yeah, whatever, man. You're a figment of my imagination. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then Odin goes well out of his way to show you it's not a hallucination. It's real. Really, really real. Right? So then, all of a sudden, as you're chilling, you know, you're like, okay, you come to the realization that you're Thor. You're like, all right, shit, I guess I'm Thor. So you're like, how, what am I supposed to do? So you say to Odin, like, dude, all right, cool, what am I supposed to do? What, what does Thor do? I don't understand what Thor does. So Odin tells you, it's like, um, your job is to go to Earth and collect brave souls. We're going to bring them over to Valhalla. And then we're going to get rid of the rest of the species, right? And you're like, that's wild. Okay, what? I don't know what to do with that information, but okay. So, all right, bet. Give me, give me Mjolnir. And, you know, it's like, I guess I'll be on my way. And Odin's like, nah, nah. You don't, you don't get Mjolnir. And you're like, wait, wait a minute, what? He's like, nah, you can't have Mjolnir. And you're like, but I'm supposed to be Thor. And I'm supposed to go down here and collect brave souls. Odin's like, nah, you can't have Mjolnir because it's a powerful weapon. If you have a powerful weapon, cowards are mob up behind you. Here we're looking for brave souls. We're not looking for cowards. We're getting rid of all the cowards. So you're going there without Mjolnir because any coward will mob up behind any coward will mob up behind a person with a powerful weapon an authority figure so you're like all right cool i can't have milnor well at least do i get my lightning and odin's like nah you can't have that either and you're like so i'm supposed to be thor i'm supposed to go here and collect brave souls what reason does anyone have to believe that i'm thor Right? And Odin's like, I tell you what, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give you information about Valhalla that nobody else has. In fact, I'm gonna give you knowledge of humans, and of the human species that nobody else has. And that's how you sort the brave from the cowardly. And as Thor, you say to Odin, I don't get it. How does that work? And Thor's like, I mean, Odin is like, you see, only the brave are going to risk everything they think they know and their identities to hear about the secrets of Valhalla and the secrets that they've even been searching for answers to for centuries. 
Only the brave are to be strong enough to set aside their identities long enough to understand you. That is how you separate, that is how you separate the brave from the cowards. So you set out, you start sharing the secrets of Valhalla. And it's just, just as Odin said it would be. Only the brave are strong enough to interact with you. Only the brave are strong enough to deal with you. Not for you wielding Mjolnir and tearing down structures, scaring people with all your might and power, not from shooting thunderbolts from your fingertips, but by simply speaking the truth that no one is brave enough to hear. That'd be a hell of a test, wouldn't it? You as Thor, trying to get people, not even to believe that you're Thor, but to be brave enough to make it to Valhalla. Valhalla.